it's your girl Chanel aka Nelly B and as a part of my natural entrepreneurship series I am here with one of my favorite makeup artists in the whole wide world Mawasi aka Mo Martin Hi everyone! Uh, if you guys are familiar a few videos back I did my makeup course with her so of course I had to have her on my video so thank you for you know taking the time to do this with me my first question would be why did you get into makeup? Um, my initial interest in makeup started because, I mean, which girl doesn't want to look prettier? You know, we always want to enhance ourselves. I remember watching BET back in the day and looking at the video models and like, wow! Yeah, it's so cute! <laughs> and I wanted to be cute too! So I started playing around with the lip glosses, etc. And then it evolved into a form of artistic expression. Um, I went through a dark period in my life and I found that it was a good form of therapy for me. The colors were so lifting to my mood and I got to express the darkness I was feeling within so it was also therapeutic. And now I've combined the two and do a bit of creative and beauty makeup as well. One of the things that drew me to mm. more to you was your creative makeup. Uh, insert picture here, I'm going to show you guys a picture that she did of me. Uh, the Japanese cherry blossom as if we worked together and it definitely was not the last time mm -hmm. and what I appreciate about you as a makeup artist is the fact that you can merge those two from bridal to carnival makeup you have that range which I think appeals to a lot of people so where do you see yourself in five years in terms of your business okay in five years um, if I am doing makeup it will just be for the love of it I want to expand my brand to having stores and um, like branches of makeup stores and supplying beauty supplies. I definitely see myself doing more teaching, more workshops and um, doing it on large scales even if it's to be around the Caribbean and even writing a makeup book eventually. I like the idea of a makeup book. I don't really think I've seen a makeup book that tailors to us in the Caribbean. You more see the North American or you type. So I think that would be cool that we know you have that type of book here. Mm -hmm. uh, another question regarding your makeup is what do you think sets you apart from other makeup artists? Well, the fact that I can do both beauty and creative, oftentimes makeup artists specialize you'll see the beauty you'll see those who do um, SFX you see those who do purely creative I think my range um, and versatility mm -hmm. sets me apart also the way I combine colors and, and do crazy things yeah. I get visions in my head people <laughs> <laughs> and then I wake up the next day and like I have to put this and that together and, and, and that's what you know the, the bright tell well we call it kaleidoscopic colors Good. So on to the hair guys. Mo is my hair crush, but I'm sure she will tell you Mo's a lazy natural. Sorry. <laughs> Mo has beautiful, coarse, thick, long oh. hair. And I'm here like, give me your hair. <laughs> and she's a lazy natural. So please ex expand on your hair care or lack thereof. Hair care. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um I could take better care of my hair. I could do the moisturizing <laughs> and the LOC and all that and in my mind I'm like it's there for it. But oftentimes when people see my hair, they're like, oh my god, a hair and that is just jeans. Whether I take care of my hair or not, it could be dry as what well. it's not going to break off and fall apart. My hair just grows. So I am just lucky like that. However, I have made a resolution in my 30s to take better care of myself and I'm planning to move on to my hair soon. <laughs> I don't know why, honestly. But I try, I try. I think if anything regarding <laughs> influence on hair, folks, I have tried. Mm. I have tried with more than She has hair. tried, she has I tried. tried. She is not, oh. <laughs> she is free. <laughs> <laughs> she can wash her hands of me. <laughs> Except for what, the baggy method? Oh, oh my god, that was the best. <laughs> 
<laughs> that was the best because I was like America. I just like, oh wait, all I need to do is put a bag in my head and get up in the morning. I'm right here, so fun. For those of you who aren't familiar bad. with the yeah. baggy method, basically it's you know putting moisturizer or your oil on your hair mm -hmm. and then putting on a shower cap or plastic bag, hence the baggy method, and allowing extra moisture to come out of that. So we do it for me if I need the extra moisture, I would do it overnight, and your hair feels soft and wonderful come morning time i need the extra moisture all the time okay so it's she's like every week baggy method <laughs> she's addicted yes away. i am a wig addict it allows <laughs> versatility it allows me not to have to touch my head every day but this is not a wig <laughs> but, but natural hair is as versatile as a wig though it's kind of consuming. <laughs> <laughs> a wig is just throw and walk out the door, you know. <laughs> I love my natural hair. I I grew up natural. I never relaxed my hair, and um, the wig is just a way for me to experiment with something else. Without the commitment. Without the commitment, because I'll never commit to anything but this. I think it's so interesting that I express myself through my hair rather than you express yourself through your makeup. Mm -hmm. Oh, what would happen if you started expressing yourself through your hair? I think I would see pink and green. You might see things sticking and out things sticking and out. going that high and uh, it's going to be crazy. I'm good. <laughs> 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 Good man. I love it. I love it. Well, more thanks again You're for welcome. being a part of my series. Mm -hmm. Guys, I will leave the information to her Facebook page and all her other contacts in the description box. If you are in East Trinidad or it doesn't matter where you are, she will come to you. She does well, bridal, she does carnival makeup, she does any and everything you want something out there, she can do that as well. So. <laughs> so I'll leave all her information in the description box and guys stay tuned for the next episode until next time take care and God bless bye, bye. <laughs>